want to show you how you are going to adjust your valve setting on Perkins engine. This is six cylinder Perkins. As you can see, the engine now I want to adjust the valves. I will show you the simplest way to adjust the valve. You will be turning your engine, and as you are turning your engine, don't you kick starter. Use manual to turn your engine. You follow the firing order. You know the firing order of six cylinder Perkins is one, five, three, six, two, four. That is the firing order. You follow the fire that is the first thing to say is your number one how will you set your number one this is your number one here these two you want to say these two you know your number one and your number six is moving together so you go to your number six here you rotate your engine to clockwise manually to clockwise when your exhaust valve is rock and it's about to be coming up i think it has go down it's about to be coming up then these these two number one will free then you adjust these two that is it you adjust these two your inlet and exhaust then you go to your final order again you check number five number five piston number five and number two are working together this is your number two and this is your number five they are working together so you want to set the number five you come to your number two you turn your engine when the exhaust of number two this is the this is my exhaust when my exhaust is down it has a rock and it's about to be coming up it has open and it's about to be coming up then you set your number five you see you set number five these two you adjust it you follow the the fire the the manual the filler gauge to adjust it then then you go to your drawing board again you pick number three next number five you know that is number three this is our number three this is our number three in this now what will you do you your number three and number four is working together this is our number four you go to your exhaust this is my exhaust I allow this my exhaust to open when it when it open and when it rock it goes down it pull the spring totally when it's about to be coming up then you, you adjust your inlet and exhaust of your number three then you go to your number six your number six and number one is moving together remember now this is my number six to adjust this inlet and exhaust what will i do i come here when i come here i allow my exhaust is exhaust when your exhaust is going down as it now soon as it goes down and you want to start coming up i adjust this very two i adjust my number six now number two your number two and number five is is working together. I want to adjust number five, my inlet and exhaust, exhaust number two now. I come to my number five. I align my exhaust to rock totally. And it's about to be coming up. I adjust my number two, both inlet and exhaust at the same time. Now the last one is number four. You remember number four and number three is working together? You come to your number three. Pick the exhaust valve. As soon as my exhaust valve is rock totally, they adjust my number four. That is how to adjust. Uh, in line six cylinder engine in as much as the firing order is one five three six two four that is how to adjust it then you can see where the the, the oil supply there is a hole on your rocker arm make sure the oil is supplied this is the means in which the oil is supplying to this rock arm as soon as you adjust the valve you know use your screw you lose this bolt you adjust the valve here you should be luggage to adjust it and you start your engine and the engine will give you maximum output that is how to adjust your valve now after adjusting your valve what will you do you observe your engine see how the engine is performing and that will really help you to see how the efficiency your engine is thank you so much don't forget to subscribe to my channel this is five six cylinder engine watch my next video thank you for watching my video hope you enjoy it you can now see how to adjust six cylinder engine in a very simple way that is me for you i teach to a layman for you to understand are you very simple grammar for you to understand what i'm teaching thank you very much see you in my next video thank you